Hi there, this is Aravind here. Welcome back. Today, we'll be looking at something really, really interesting. Most of us, uh, particularly those who are in the computer science or related STEM field, might be familiar with this particular platform called as Geeks for Geeks, right? So whenever we search for some topics, maybe like deadlock or some, some sort of topics which is related to our field, this particular page will be popping up first in front of our search results, right? Geeks for Geeks. So most of the people know Geeks for Geeks, where, which is similar to Wikipedia or Quora, which provides answers to almost all of our technical queries, right? So, and most of those guys, most of these guys doesn't know what lies behind this platform called as Geeks for Geeks. So Geeks for Geeks is actually an amazing platform which can be utilized by anyone who wants to uh, practice and be better version of themselves in the field of computer science. So let's look here. When we go to this particular website called as geeksforgeeks.org, we'll be landing in this particular page, right? And it shows that uh, there's tutorials available, student section, courses and all. So now, um, most of us know some courses are offered by them, right? And I also didn't know there's much more lying behind Geeks or Geeks until recently when I started to dig out more out of this platform. So when we look at in the front page, there's some, um, what can we say, articles regarding various technology topics. Okay, and anyone can use it. And towards the left side there's a uh, list of the topics available which can be selected from here so if we want algorithms then we can select any algorithm maybe greedy algorithm or dynamic algorithm and many things are available in this website but actually there's more to it so if we select the tutorials almost the similar uh, thing will be coming over here algorithms data structures then gate preparation interview corner then web technology cs subjects and many more like if, if you click on the cs subjects this kind of subjects like mathematics operating system dbms and many more such cs related topics like non-programming related topics will be appearing over here and when we select the student section there's some more to it internship careers campus geeks uh, campus ambassador program then community programming and many more and when we click on this courses will be taken to another page that is practice.geeksforgeeks.org okay so here you can see uh, there are many things over here okay so right now as you can see over here independence day sale is going on and right now i'm recording this on 15th of august okay so independence day sales are going on by the way uh, i am not sponsored to do this video i'm just doing this out of pure interest because this is such an amazing platform like the worker.tech platform which we unraveled last day in the last video okay so if you want you can try out the skill independence days say uh, the sales associated with that the contest associated with that you might land up some free courses okay but wait there's something more uh, which you might have read in the title okay there's something more and just wait a little more and i'll just uh, let you know how you can avail that for free obviously okay so as you can see over here there are live courses over here then there are online courses over here and if you and there are some courses which are enrolled in and if you click on live courses and maybe online courses you can see in the uh, live courses okay wait a minute okay in the live courses there are some courses like competitive programming big data with hadoop ios app development full stack then comes competitive programming live geek classes live then there are many more okay so uh, just keep in mind that the prices are actually reduced and if you're planning to buy one course this thing is really amazing okay i can guarantee that the content product by geeks of geeks is truly top notch and then in the online courses uh, the other was live courses and now it's the online courses as you can see over here complete interview preparation is over there then osd bms cn4 sd interview preparation dsa self-paced courses there then fundamentals of java and collections again then dsa and algo foundations sd test series c plus plus stl uh, yeah dsa uh, self-paced with doubt assistance and many more are available over here so these are actually really amazing topics which anyone can actually purchase and learn and it's truly top notch i can guarantee you that so as i said earlier i have enrolled in, into some of the courses 
so let's just have a brief look at this dsa self-paced course so when i click on the see details over here it will be taking me to this particular page where it is providing more details regarding the course and the first thing you see over here is the course rating it's 4.9 Trust me, this is not made up stuff, it's actually real. The 4.9 rating is there out of 5 because it it offers such true, uh, truly top notch content. Okay, so here you can uh, briefly view what all things you'll be learning, then the course features, then the content. Uh, I did a little bit more in depth. Okay, there are a lot more things uh which is basically covering almost all the data success and algorithm for your interview preparation and this course is 2499 for the time being and there's one more such course this was dsa self-paced then there's one with doubt assistance which goes a little much more and then there comes ds and algo foundations and let's look at that course in detail because here's something for you okay you can see the price is 1499 for the time being and you can uh, find the almost uh, similar contents which was present in the DSA self-paced course too. The analysis of algorithm, marriage, recursion, hashing and almost everything which was nearly, nearly everything which was present in the uh, DSA self-paced course. So uh, this is currently available for 1499 and if so there's a lot more and this this video this course is also super amazing so you can uh, maybe you can reach out to me for the C++ STL course if you want that. You can reach out for the uh, this particular course or SDBMSC and for SD interview preparation or, or nearly any topic. Okay, then uh, this also offers a lot of test preparation courses or kind of the test preparations, which is also truly top notch. I haven't tried that uh, personally, uh, so I can't comment on that further. So yeah, that's it regarding the courses about that. Then coming to the other section, oh, you can actually practice. You might have heard about pl platforms like Lead Code, Code Chef, Code Forces, and many more, right? So you can actually do that particular thing in this particular platform itself. So when you click on Explore over here, you'll be taken to this particular page where you can view a lot of questions based on various um interview preparation topics so here you can see check for bst then loop in linked list binary tree reverse linked list and a lot of topics so here you can sort them too okay if you want to sort them with the uh, difficulty level uh, then you can uh, actually select that okay then removing that school then let's if you want to uh, arrange it in the company specific way you can do that too that is you can see as you can see over here there are some company tags over here if you want you can go with amazon microsoft adobe there are a lot more which can be selected from this big list okay actually geeks for geeks is a platform an amazing platform worth the efforts of nearly uh, i think 10 plus years from the founder and it's actually truly top notch this platform was created for the sole purpose of helping all the cs enthusiasts with these particular topics because there didn't exist such a platform when, until it was created okay it might be confusing for you to understand but it was actually this all intention for this platform so you can actually try out a, anything from here if you want uh, you can select that particular thing and from that you can uh, view, uh, check the question say uh, look at the samples and you can actually uh, solve that too in this inbuilt id over here so i'm not going to solve that over here okay i just started off with this and it's actually super amazing and you can uh, go to your profile section and finally you'll be able to find a lot more details uh, like uh, how, how many problems you have solved uh, your the languages you use the uh, your contribution patterns and yeah many more such stuffs okay and finally if you want you can also contribute to the geeks for geeks in the form of articles uh, wherever you are you have expertise in so you can just click on contribute over here and you'll be taken to this particular page where you can either write an article from scratch or write an article on suggested topics or you can provide your own interview experiences and if you are providing a good number of articles you might even get paid for that okay i don't i'm not saying that you will get paid for each and every article you will be paid if you um, are consistently contributing to this particular community and this thing is truly top notch 
actually i have uh, contributed one article to this uh, platform and it's it was actually an enriching experience okay after submitting they will be um, checking each and everything which I, which we have added on our uh, article and only after that it will be approved so yes uh, this is actually about this geeks for geeks platform so just and yeah that's it for this video uh, see you then so until the next one